Okay, let's get started. Um, so, first thing, let's talk about the light. Um, uh, when I show on location, I usually bring uh, Profoto B2. I own the B1 and B2, but I found Profoto B2 is just a lot easier to use when you show on location because uh, the weight is uh, really well balanced, and I'll explain that later. So this is a Profoto B2. And one light is enough. B2 come, uh, you can attach two light to the B2, but uh, 99% of the time, I'm okay with just one light. Okay, then it's the camera lens trigger. Put this away. So I shoot with uh, most of the time Sigma, either a 75 art or 50 art. Uh, I don't usually bring two lenses with me. Uh, usually, uh, Last year I did a lot of shoot with uh, 50 mil. This year, start this year I use a uh, 35 more and more. I really like the 35 R lens. This is a really great lens. So that's the the B2, the light. Then this is a Profoto OCF Speed Ring. Um, it works only with the Profoto OCF uh, modifiers. Uh, these uh, these three modifiers what I use. Uh, uh, the most. Uh, this is a Profoto uh, Super Beauty Dish, uh, 2x3 softbox, and the Deep Umbrella 01 and the medium size. Okay, I didn't bring all of these with me, so it depends on what I shoot. Um, so, um, usually I bring just one or two of them with me. Um, for the umbrella, they're pretty good for full body shot, beauty dish. You can do great, like three quarter of hat shot with the beauty dish, and uh, two by three is in general uh, can cover both because you can rotate it. Uh, it's two by three, and you can also make it by three by two, so you can rotate that. So it's a very uh, um, how to say multi-purpose softbox. So let's say if we can only bring one modifiers, and uh, I want to cover many different looks, and I probably want to shoot like even uh, two different themes and go to two different locations to shoot I'll bring this one with me, absolutely for sure and then the light stand um, I don't use a C stand on location and obviously because uh, it's too heavy uh, when I shoot I don't usually have a, a system with me so most of the time I'm shooting with myself just myself and model and sometimes makeup artist so I need the, the whole setup very mobile. Um, I don't like carry very heavy C stand. Yeah, they're they're good. They're very stable and they're they're very durable. They're less likely to get damaged. But the thing is, they're super heavy. Uh, just any normal light stand will totally do the work. Um, also, uh, there's a one feature I really like about Profoto B2 is that. Uh, the difference between B1 and B2, the main thing for me is uh, not just the power. It's uh, the way, uh, the way that uh, the way is uh, how to say. Mm, B2 is more weight balanced. B1 is more head heavy. Let's say you have a B1. I don't know how it feels like 10, 15 pounds of a strobe light on the top of your light stand. Then you attach the light modifier. Then when there's a wind it's very likely it's going to tip over. So you always need either sandbag it or you need a system to hold the light for you. And neither of them is the best option for me. So it's not like B2. B2 is your light and your power pack is separated. I know people complaining, oh, they don't like the cable. Uh, you know what? I don't mind the cable at all. Um, there is a... So if you buy the Profoto B2 kit, they give you this little... They give you this little strap, which is very useful. So what you do is like you can use it to attach your B2 to your light stand, to the bottom of your light stand. So let me do a demo here. So this is my light stand. I open it up. Right? So, okay. Then I can simply attach the B2 to the bottom of my light stand. And then 
the power pack will be work also as a sandbag. It helps to balance it. So I put this on the floor. Then I attach my B2 light to it. So you can see this is really well balanced like combo. And you don't really have to worry about it can tip over or anything because most of the weight is at the bottom. And it can easily take care of an umbrella or something with no problem at all. So let's just quick open up the umbrella. So this is a this is deep deep umbrella silver one. I like using silver one. Uh, I'll make another video of talking about why I think silver one is better than the white one. So yeah, there we go. So attach the B2 light to it. Then yeah, this is a this is a really fast setup. And then it take me probably five minutes to get everything set up. Then I'm ready to shoot. And I have a sandbag here. And everything on top is really lightweight, so it's perfect. So same the case for the 2x3 and the Silver Beauty Dish. Yeah, so that's it. That's my life setup. And um, uh, in the future, I'll talk more about uh, uh, which modifier to use on, what's, uh, on which situation. And then follow up, I'll give you, I'll put some uh, sample photo there so you can see like what type of photos, uh, what type of effect you can capture with this setup. Uh